La luz ya se va Tus ojos cerrarás Y te dormirás Hacia un mundo ideal Donde todo es Una hermosa y bella verdad Hacia Dios en busca del amor y de la paz que hay allí en el cielo y las estrellas. La luz ya se va y te dormirá. La luz ya se va y te dormirá. stories to be a bit. You know, you're filling his head up with foolish thoughts. It's pleasant to dream, Margarita. A long time ago, I had a dream about you. And when I woke up, it came true. More foolishness. Well, in the village today, Manolo told me that the most beautiful woman in Kintai married me. Why did you do it? You could have had Pablo, Jose, they say even Don Francisco wanted you. But you married me. Why did you do it? I was crazy. I like to wake to the morning sunshine. The sun starts his daily watch To feel the warmth of the land below me The only mark of its tender touch It's really strange how a busy ocean Can come disguised as a gentle rain a rainbow ribbon above me to fade away like forgotten pain. Many are the blessings that one cannot see. Man is running to keep up, not running free. Always searching for a long for a life of ease Neither self no others can he ever please I like to look at the earth around me Knowing my gift to it may well be That I a man passed this way so briefly I paused and looked and smiled gratefully. La 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 
Señora, buenos días. El carro que me vendiste estaba quebrado. Pero está bueno que no se lo vendí. No, estaba quebrado. Pero mis carros nunca se quiebran, señora. ¿Por qué no le vendo uno nuevo por la mitad de precio? No, si no me das uno nuevo, me devuelve el dinero. Está bueno. But they never break, unless you drop them. Oh. Good morning, Carmen. What's so good about it? It was Raul's birthday last night. And the bastard kept us working the whole night long. Well, that's too bad. Is Don Francisco in? Yes, he's inside. Good. Antonio. Oh, Antonio, come with me. I need something. I need a six plates huh? and a, a, a dozen two balls. You got it? And one water pitcher. One water pitcher. This is my favorite. How much is it? Ah, uh, let's see. Uh... Night of schoolers? Night of schoolers? Well, that includes the water pitcher. Ah, <laughs> night of schoolers, you say? Night of schoolers, let's watch you owe me. Here, here, Antonio. Twenty schoolers for you. Twenty schoolers, Don Francisco? Night of Raven. Bueno. Muchas gracias, Don Francisco. Adios. Adios, Antonio. Saludos a Margarita, eh? Señor Marín, ¿cómo está Juanito? Muy bien, gracias, Antonio. 
Manolo! Manolo! Look at the size of that boat! Ah, you think that ship is big? You ought to go to Valparaiso. There they have ships ten times bigger than that. Battleships, aircraft carriers. I hit ten ah. times bigger? That's, that's hard to believe. Lento, lento! Hey, Captain, I sure appreciate the way you've been taking care of the boss. I told you get off in the last floor. We could have unloaded you right in the pier. Yeah, well, I didn't like the looks of the road there. So, uh, here, on the way home, you buy oh, a little more. Oh, no, hell, you do a damn fine job, boy. Yes. All right, boys, let's get this show on the road here. Uh, lift it up. Uh, lift up. Uh, levanten. Hey, levanten! Uh, hey, that's it. Come on, rope there. Come on, in. Over. Over this way a little bit. That's why I keep telling you to leave Kintai. You can't imagine what the rest of the world is like until you have a look around. Oh, God, now be careful. Now you follow this man, bro. I'm going to put your damn ass now. Come on, boys. Get it. Yeah, that's it. Hold that way. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Hold that way. They're starting to unload! Two and a half tons. Two and a half tons? Can the accent pull that? Well, I'll go find out. Yeah, go. Come on. Trouble. You got a brand new car, plenty of gas. I don't know what the hell's wrong with it. Yeah. Is there a garage in this town? Uh, the Calderon brothers have a garage up the hill. Up that hill? Yes, sir. All right, I tell you what to do. You get them oxen and we'll hook it up this thing. We'll drag it up there. Well, I'm not an oxen man, but I will help you, senor. All right, boy, you help me and I help you. That's what makes the world go around, right? Right. <laughs> Damn, I should have brought my Cadillac. I knew it. I knew it. Or old Lincoln. Oh. Damn, I need this thing. Damn far cars anyhow. <laughs> Oh, my God. 
Uh, how you doing there? Uh, I got a little problem here. I was wondering if you'd take a look under the hood. I'm not the expert in the car, sir. My brother is the expert in the cars. I work in the trucks. Oh, okay. I go and get my brother. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Carlos! Uh, yeah. Oh, hey, listen, I really appreciate what you did for me here, and I don't want to tie up them rocks no more. Uh, take them back down to the beach and hear something, little woman. Here. Oh, no, no, senor. Oh, no, no. go on. Go on. No, no, senor. I'll drive them home. Yeah. Uh, no, uh, you, you don't have to, senor. Uh, you were in trouble, and I helped you. Oh, well, that's, that's mighty kind for you. I, I, I'd rather pay you, you know. It's all right. Cut. Uh, this is my brother, Carlos. Oh, down there, Carlos. Uh, I was wondering if you could take a look under the hood here. The uh, hood, sir. Yeah, brand new car. It's a brand new car. Yeah, it couldn't be much wrong. Couldn't be much wrong, sir. Oh, here, let me uh, get this. Here you go. There. <laughs> it's a very beautiful car, sir. I need to rush into things. Oh, well, you just rush right in. That's all right. I got a slew of people waiting for me down in Santiago, so it's all right. You just rush right in. It's only to be siren. Uh, but uh, why didn't you go and have a little lunch, maybe? Huh? While he looking for things. No, I don't want no lunch. Could you use a drink? Oh, damn. You know what? I gotta call those people down there and tell them I'm gonna be late. Uh, can I borrow your phone? Uh, we have no phone, sir. You got no phone? We, well, it's a phone in the police station, but it's out of order, sir. <sighs> Where you get a drink around here? Well, there's Francisco's place. Francisco? See? Let's go to Francisco, senor. Hey, yeah. Uh, you all do a good job, huh? Mark L. Hunter, you remember yes. I remember you when I get back. Huh? Yes, sir. Yes, Come on, Carlos. Yes, sir. Tadito, tadito. Vamos a tomar el año completo en arreglar. Por lo menos un año. Buenos días, San Francisco. Buenos días, Antonio. Buenos días, señor. Yes, uh, I'd like a double bourbon, please. I don't have any bourbon, sir. Oh. Now, what you got? We have beer, yeah. wine, good wine, and pisco. Pisco? What's that? Pisco is our local whiskey, sir. Any good? The best. Pisco is the best. Give me those uh, piscos and those... Uh, Cerveza. Cerveza, yeah, yeah. Borrow my amigo. Right? Okay. I don't drink, senor. Huh? No, I don't drink. Oh, yeah? No. Hey, listen, I can't go around in car calling you senor all the time. What the hell's your name? Antonio Contreras. Antonio Contreras. Yeah. Yeah. Mark L. Hunter. Good to know you, boy. Gracias. <coughs> we have a beautiful place here, don't we? Yeah, yeah, it's nice. Yeah, nice little. Niñas, niñas, hay clientes. What do you do, Antonio? What do you mean? Oh, I mean, what do you do for a living? Uh, you got a profession or something? Well, I'm a potter. Uh, a what? A potter. I make things with clay. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> See? Any money in that? Well, I make a living. Yeah, I bet you do. <clears throat> You leave the bottle here. How much is that damn thing in here? Two hundred escudos, senor. What? Two hundred escudos. <coughs> hey, you pay him out, will you? Sweet. Oh, that's something. There. <coughs> well, that's got a nice body to it, I'll tell you. <coughs> that's all. <coughs> that's the price in the bottle, Don Francisco. Antonio. Good morning. Oh, hi. Hi, senorita. How you doing? <laughs> you speak English, huh? Hello, Hansel. Uh, 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 how you doing? Uh, where'd you learn English? At school. That's cool. Huh? How far did you go? Far enough. <laughs> God, I don't think we got a lot of water. See, <laughs> yeah. senor, uh, about the car? Hmm? Your car. We have to see about oh, the car. Oh, God, yeah. We may find out what's wrong with that damn thing. Maybe they have already. Hey there, boys. How you doing? Oh. Mr. Hunter, you're back again. Yeah, I thought I'd come check on and see how you all doing there. Oh, we're doing fine, sir. Good, good. Good news for you, my brother Carlos found the trouble. 
We found the travel through, which is the difficult part. Here is in the distributor. Is this out of my car? The reason it's out of your car, sir, is easy to work on. Well, we have to put it through a series of tests, points, condensator, motor advance. Yeah, yeah, look, I, I don't understand all that. Uh, well, when's it going to be ready? When is it going to be ready? When is it going to be ready? Tomorrow? Tomorrow. Good morning, senor. Good morning. You guys expect me to stay in the night in this flea bitten town? Well, sir, tomorrow is going to be like a brand new car. Hell, it is a brand new car. It's a beauty. Mr. Hunter, while you're waiting, may I show you around our town? Oh, yeah, that'd be a lot of fun. same thing for years. There are no more opportunities here for you. I don't want you to spend the rest of your life in a spent town. Well, what about you, Manolo? I've already lived my life, Antonio. You're a young man. You have your whole life ahead of you. I'll buy somebody a drink and they find me a place to stay. You could stay here. Well, I appreciate that, but uh, see what I'll buy you a drink and talk about, huh? in town, senor. Well, yeah. Can you get anything to eat here? Oh, the food is very good here. I catch the fish every day. Yeah? See? The Congre are the best in the country here. Yeah? Hey, yeah, the fishermen, they make any money here? They make a pretty good living. What? They make a pretty good living, senor. Yeah? See? Uh, why don't you be a fisherman? I love pottery. Huh? I love pottery. Yeah. Different strokes for different boats, I always say. <laughs> hey, uh, Antonio, you ever been any place out of this place? Uh, I've never been out of Quintay, senor. Huh? Never been. Yeah? Never been to uh, Valparaiso or, um, uh, Vina or one of them little towns? Uh. No? No, senor. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, there you are. 
There's a hell of a lot more out there in the world than this dump. I'll tell you that right now, boy. <laughs> uh, how about you, Manolo? I was a chauffeur. Yeah. Now getting work. In Santiago. I work for uh, Mr. Vial. Yeah. Yeah. In Santiago. Yeah. Uh, George Vial? Jorge. Jorge Vial? Si. You know? You work for Jorge Vial? <laughs> you old oh, press you know. yeah. He's the guy that's supposed to meet me down in Santiago. No, Hell not. yes, little yeah. guy in a wheelchair. That's with the gout. Ate himself with window the wheel. That's right, man. He's got to eat all the time. <laughs> you know what I'm doing? I told hey, you. Hey, I told you we knew somebody in common. See, you go around any place in the world, you meet somebody you know. Hey, uh, let's have some more of that spices over here and uh, some uh, more pisco and uh, some uh, a rose compola. We'll get some to eat when with bread and butter. What the hell is that? Funny with the gift. Fine. Fine and mine to kill you. Come on, come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hell, let's get over here. And some pescadores. We eat some of that congress. Congress? Congrio. Congrio. Yeah, let's have a little of that, boys. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I can see it's going to be one of those nights, boy. I can just feel it. <laughs>
You're in my house, senor. Huh? In my house. Who the hell are you? Oh, I, I'm Antonio. Antonio Contreras. Remember? Oh, oh. Pisco. We have no pisco, senor. Well, I'll just take a cup of coffee then. Oh, I'm sorry, senor. Uh, no coffee. You better call me a taxi. Taxi? Let 
так, а? Oh yeah, that no, oh, that looks hell a lot better. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. Well, I'm glad to see you boys got together. But she doesn't start though. Doesn't start, sir. Huh? The car does the start. <sighs> All right, boys, now give me the bottom line, will you? I mean, tell me how long it's going to take. Huh? It's going to be one day or two days or three or four. You know, just tell me so I can make arrangements for my life. Quiet. Would you? ¿Cuántos días? Si sabemos, Antonio, cuántos días. Bueno, quiero decirle dos días, tres días. Diez, cinco, cuatro. ¿Me leeré este año? Cinco días. Cinco días. Okay. Quiero decirle de ir a Ibiña y volver para que mande la parte. Pues, creo que... Uh, it's going to take five days. Five days? Are you kidding? I can't wait around here five more days. Now, what the hell's wrong with you? I, I can't. Listen, I kicked him out of his bed last night. I can't stay here five more days. My boys, give me a more realistic number than that. Damn. What's that? What's that up there? What's that? Oh, that's the bus, senor. Where does it go? It goes to Valparaiso, past the airport to Quinteros. That's the airport. Let's get the bags out of the back of my car. Uh, we don't have the parts here. Sure like the way you treat me, Antonio. Now I'm going to treat you good right back. Here. I want you to sign a little something. Right on the bottom line, see? You're right there? Go ahead, sign. OK, let's go. I'm already late. Uh-huh. All aboard! For Valparaiso Quintero Aeroporto, all aboard! Great, great. You're now the proud owner of a brand new Mercedes Benz that ain't worth a damn. You got some possessions now, Antonio. You can play your cards right. You change your life, boy. But I'm Mr. Hunter. I cannot take your card. I wouldn't know what to do with it. Well, the first thing you ought to do is load your little kid and your wife in it and get the hell out of this town. You talk to Manolo. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, I'll be at the San Cristobal Sheraton if you want to come by and say hello. Here. Yeah. I'm Mr. Hunter. I paid it, Antonio. You holding out the bus. Uh, Mr. Hunter, I cannot take your car. Hell, I got five more just like it at home. Mr. Hunter, please, don't do this to me. Please. I already did. But, uh, Mr. Hunter, I do not know how to drive. You learn. You learn. What do I do now? Antonio. Margarita. What's wrong, Antonio? Margarita, M Mr. Hunter has given me his car. Es un auto hermoso, nuevo, brillante. Sí. Tiene que costar una fortuna. Yes, it must be very expensive. You're rich, Antonio. Now you can pay me what you owe me. I am not rich. I'm the same as before. Now you can pay the money you owe me. Me too. Uh, I have no money. Let's go to the car. shouldn't do this. I'll pay you what I owe you. You can have the front seat. I'll take the back seat. Come on, you don't need a radio. I need the diet for my back. Stop it, all of you. You're acting like animals. What's the matter? Now get back. I didn't expect this of you or you. Let's go. Get back, I'll break your head. 
Manolo. Thank you. If there's anything, I can't stand it. People acting like animals. All right, Antonio. You can take your lousy cat out of here, but before you do that, you better pay us for our labors. What labors? You didn't do anything. Oh, yeah? It took us a long time to find out something we couldn't fix. All right, Manolo, get out of here. Antonio, I gotta lock up this guy in the garage. Can they do that, Manolo? No, but it's safer in there than out here with these vultures. <laughs> they can come and take the car away. You know what I would do if I had a family like yours? I'd clean them up, pack them into the car, and take them on a trip to the city. Let them see some of the things I saw when I worked for Vial. Mujeres elegantes, muchachas bonitas, the grand boulevards, beautiful fountains, hotels, Antonio, 20 stories high, with crystal chandeliers and elevator cages that go up and up and up. You sure can put things into someone's head, Manolo. Is it all right? Ah, oh, it's good, Margarita. Antonio, why are you making such a big bowl? Who's gonna buy it? Somebody will. I'm sure of it. Not in Quintai. Antonio, what's gotten into you? A car we can't use? A bowl too big to sell? Give it back, please, Antonio. Give, give the car back and to the people, so at least we can pay out our debt. No, no, Margarita. Be sensible, please. The car belongs to Antonio. The American gave it to him. He shouldn't give it back to the vultures just because they want it. He has to fight to keep it. If I'm going to give the car to anybody, I'm going to find Mr. Hunter and give it back to him. I have to go now. No, 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 we'll walk out. Remember, Antonio, the car belongs to you. You must do whatever you want with it. Good night, Margarita. Good night, Manila. Think about the trip. Thank you, Manila. Good night.
I will be very happy to. Oh, I'm sorry, senor. Did I hurt your car? Um, no, no, it doesn't matter. But we entered your bumper a little, uh, not too much. Uh, <laughs> but uh, it can be fixed, sir. Oh, I think we better push it by hand. Uh, thank you, anyways, eh? Well, uh, where are you going? Maybe I can give you a ride. The tune? It's just to the other side of town, sir. Well, well, come on anyway. I'll give you a ride. Oh, no, please. You would honor us. Come, 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 come. something of value, we wouldn't have been invited here. Well, perhaps the thing of value got us in, but it's because you are you that we have been allowed to stay, then. <laughs> celebrate the wedding of the daughter of our honored host. Thank you, brother. We also have the grace of having with us Don Antonio Contreras. Oh. 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 
well, what about your wedding, Don Antonio? Now, that must have been something to see. Well, you see, uh, ours was a very simple occasion. We uh, fell in love with each other, and we lived together for almost a year before we were <laughs> married. Uh, Antonio, tell the Padre why. Well, you see, uh, Padre, we're from the village of Quintay, and the priest only comes there once a year. So we put our trust and our love and have faith that the Lord will be patient with us until the priest returns. This is not Quintay, Emilio. So don't you get any funny thoughts in your head. Ay! Mi felicitación, el paisón! Mi felicitación. I hope you will be feliz con Anita. Mamá, huh? he is Don Antonio, and he is already married. You marry again? Mamá, he is the gentleman who owns the car. Ah, mira. Mi felicitación, my son. Mi felicitaciones. Que tengan una larga vida y muy feliz con Anita. <laughs> bueno, mamá. Eh, don Antonio, perdónela. <laughs> Muchas gracias, señora. Hijito, hasta luego. Felicidades, mi niño. Adiós. <laughs> mamá. <laughs> Bailen todos juntos esta canción. Que trae la alegría de mi corazón. Que viva la alegría, que vive el amor. Adiós tristezas negras, adiós dolor. Oh, oh, oh. Viva la vida, vive el amor. Cantemos todos esta canción. Viva la vida, vive el amor. Cantemos todos esta canción. Viva la vida, vive el amor. Cantemos todos esta canción. Life can be fun if only we try. Come on, everybody, I'll tell you why. Life can be fun if only we try. Come on, everybody, I'll tell you why. Dancing and laughter is so good for the soul. The love and spirit within us is worth more than gold. Vive el amor, cantemos todos esta canción. Viva la vida, vive el amor. Isn't he a nice man? Oh, sure. He can afford to be as rich. Mm, yes. But not all rich men are as humble and gracious as he is. He's just like one of us. And beneath it all, a simple, loving soul. Viva la vida, vive el amor. Cantemos todos esta canción. Sing another, please, Antonio. Oh, I'm sorry, Don Juan, but my family and I have to really be going. Oh, what a pity. But we understand, Don Antonio. Gracias. Muchas gracias. Adios. Adios. Margarita, that looks like a good place. Oh, but there's someone there already. Maybe we shouldn't bother them. We won't bother them. There's plenty of room for everybody.
Look at that. What the hell does a guy have to do to get some peace and quiet? Hey, man, how's it going, huh? Hola. Is this your place? If it is, we'll move. Uh, no, this is not our place. Then would you mind moving? I don't appreciate being barged in on like this. I'm sorry. I didn't know we were such a bother. That's the trouble with you rich guys. You don't give a damn about anyone but yourselves. Don't get uptight, Harvey. Talk about your liberated spirits. Be quiet. I'm sorry. Don't mind him. He's right, ma'am. He has a right to his privacy. You're damn right I do. Hey, hey what are you doing there? Perdón. Maybe it's the car that bothers them. It's not the car. It's what it represents. Well, if you want us to move, we will. But I, I think you have it all wrong. You see, I, I am just a potter. <laughs> you want me to swallow that? With a car like that? Pepito, go get me my big bowl, huh? Really, I, I am just a, a potter. Really. See? Wow, that's really out of sight. I dig it. Sure. How many hundreds a day do your workers turn out? Oh, no, no. Uh, you see, these are my workers. And these are my helpers. And on a good day, I can make a dozen. Really good. If you like it, you may keep it. No. We can't. Not after I made an ass of myself. Oh, no. It's it's fine. Please keep it. Please. Thank you. Tell you what. Why don't you come and sit with us and I'll fix you something. Sure. Come on up. Please. Come on. Come over. Mm, come on. Come inside. Sit down. Here. Gracias. Oh, by the way, my, my name is Harvey. And, uh, she's the lepa. Very nice to know you. This is Margarita. Hi. And Pepito. Nice meeting you, Pepito. Uh, uh, what about you? Oh, uh, my name is Antonio. Hello, Antonio. Beautiful sandals. Where did you get these? They're beautiful. Oh. He makes them. He does. Look, Antonio. They're beautiful. Very good work. Well, these are my workers. And that one is my helper. <laughs> <laughs> Antonio, what's wrong? I think we're out of gas. What are we going to do, Antonio? Maybe I can find a filling station somewhere. Oh, but be careful, please. Okay, Margarita. Be careful, please. Hurry right. back. Oh, Margarita, roll up your windows and lock your doors. And don't be afraid. I'll be right back. Senor, excuse me. Oh, yes. Do you know where I can find a filling station? It's open late? Filling station? No, I don't. I'm sorry. Do you need some gas? Si. Maybe I can help you out. Oh, oh. gracias. Please. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Did you get the stack in the tunnel? See, si. You're lucky you got out of there. Yes. The traffic is very dangerous around here. No, I'm not talking about the traffic. It's the fumes. Fifteen minutes of uh, breathing that air and it's all over. Family. They're in 
the car. The family's in the car? Si. Oh, hurry up, hurry up, get them out. Quick, quick, quick. In Kintai? Why in Kintai? Uh, well, you know my wife, Carol? The one that has two children. Yeah, that's the one. Well, she got a hold of my license plate, you know, and she she's waiting for me down in Valparaiso. Hi. <laughs> so I offloaded in Kintai instead. Well, she's uh, probably following for me your car here. Mm, no, I, I gave it away. You didn't mean to say you gave it away. Yeah, well, I met this nice little guy down there. When I read in the papers that she was looking for me, I gave it to her. <laughs> oh, well, she'll be there when you can Yeah, I hope that she is. <laughs> it cost me a car instead of half a oil well. <laughs> you understand? <laughs> Comprende oil wells? Huh? Yeah? Yeah. Her wife is here. Huh? Where's she at? At the door. Where? You hit her off, huh? Something you hit her off. Just wait. Thank you. Oh, come with you. Mr. Hunter? Who? Mr. Hunter. No, I'm sorry. I'm calling him out. Oh, excuse me. There must be something to say. Excuse me. Sorry. all of this, Antonio. Isn't this beautiful? I never imagined a whole new world outside of Quintai. Sir. Excuse me. Uh, we just drove in from Kintai, and we're looking for a friend who said he would be staying here. Uh, his name is Mark L. Hunter. Do you know him? Yes, but I think he left. If you wait a minute, I will find out. Gracias. Gracias. I hope we didn't miss him. What is it, Angelo? Did you found the car you were looking for? No, why? Have you got something for me? There is one outside now. Bright color and everything. Oh, really? Let's go take a look. I'll be back in a minute, darling. Pardon. Name is Langley. Sidney Langley. Uh, we are down here, Signora. <laughs> we are down here to shoot a couple of scenes of a picture I'm directing, and I happen to need a car just like yours. <laughs> Do you think we can arrange it some way? You are staying somewhere in town, aren't you? No, not yet. Oh, fantastic. You stay here at the Sheraton at my expense. Of course, I will give you something extra for the use of the car. What do you say? Um, 
What do you think, Margarita? We could all use a good night's sleep, Tonya. Oh, then it's all settled. Angelo, will you help this gentleman with uh, his peculiar luggage? And this ought to cover any inconvenience that you may have. Here. Oh, that's all right, senor. Oh, nonsense. Angelo, will you take care of uh, Mr... Contreras. Oh, that's it, of course. And be sure that he makes a party tonight. Uh, he was charming, then. Ta-ta. Excuse me. Yes. Did you find out about Mr. Hunter? Yes. He left for Terminal Vial. And uh, he will be there uh, the rest of the week. Gracias. Find everything to your liking? Yes, it's it's beautiful. Very good, sir. Call me if you need me for anything. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Oh, uh, excuse me. Yes, sir. Uh, I think somebody forgot this. Oh, no, sir. That compliments of the house. Margarita, you can put all of Quintana into that one little corner of this city. But it's so big, Antonio. Makes me feel like nothing. <laughs> Without you, this place is nothing, Margarita. I'm just glad that we're able to enjoy all of this together. You have given me all your love. That's all I need. I don't need all of this. Just you.
Mr. Contreras. You're a native from this country, don't you? Aren't you? Yes. Uh, you ought to know this song. Do help us sing for us. I can't stand that howling. Uh, me gusta mirar la vida sin pensar Me gusta mirar el cielo y cantar. A todas las cosas bellas que traen felicidad. El éxito de la vida, ahí está. Me gusta la risa fácil y una flor. dress you are wearing, Mrs. Uh... Contreras. Oh, yes, of course. And Mariushka wants to try it on. May I? Please do let her. May oh, be nice. Huh? Yeah, darling, come on. Looking for a dress like yours for a long time. I love native things. You don't mind, do you? Muchas gracias, Ángel. 
You have been very kind to us. Thank you, Don Antonio, and buena suerte. Gracias. Speaks a lot about you. Well, such a nice fellow. I'm going to show him that. Yeah, 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 yeah. You come on, y'all. Give me that thing. Hey, come on. Hey, everybody. Want you to meet old uh, Antonio Contreras here. Come on. Come on. Hey. Yeah, you wait till the cocktail hour gets a hell of a lot more interesting than that, huh? <laughs> hey, hey, senor. Uh, hey, everybody, this is what I've been talking about. Look at this. This is his stuff. What a magnificent piece of pottery. Where did you get it from? Oh, uh, Antonio. I didn't get it. Antonio made Come here. Hey, Antonio, come over here. This guy's made it. It's beautiful. And who is his agent? Uh, well, I guess I could be your agent. Is that all right with you? Mm. All right. What's your offer, senorita? And, well, if you get him to do some work for us, I could pay the commission gladly. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. I see there. I see. Oh, I see there. By any chance, could he line up some pots and bowls for me? It would be absolutely fantastic for my shop. Yeah, I think we could arrange a little something like that, huh? How'd you like to take a look at that, hmm? We'll take him for three years. Exclusive, hmm? Guarantee him an international show. What do you say? All right, that sounds like a pretty good deal to me. You understand the deal? He wants your, uh, he wants your services for three years exclusively. You make a hell of a lot more money than you would in King Tide. And be sure he gets into a good school. Who? The boy, of course. Oh, yeah, yeah, right, right, the boy, sure. What do you think, huh? Well, uh, may I discuss it with my family first? Sure, sure. You can discuss it with your family, and I'll discuss it with this beautiful little senior reader. Right here. How are you? <laughs> Take a look at that. Now. That's damn good work, isn't it? Huh? You got the bottom there. He's got his name, Antonio Carreras. All right, the back. Margarita, uh, I don't know what to do. Uh, this is all so tempting. Look around, Jack. Is this what you want for us? It isn't for us, Margarita. It's for Pepito, the school they will send him to. Sure, but what about all the bad things to learn from people like this? Is it worth it? Well, Pepe will have a future if we go. Uh, what can I give him in Kintai? Antonio, you can give him all the love and knowledge you have. And later, when Pepito gets older, he can decide for himself what he wants to do. Well, what about you, Margarita? 
I'm happy in Kintai, as long as I'm with you. These people are like the ones in the hotel. I've had enough of them. Hey, Antonio. Antonio, what about that deal? That's about as good as you're gonna get. Well, Mr. Hunter, um, <clears throat> uh, the life uh, you wish to make for us uh, is, is wonderful. But we, uh, we really must get back to Kintai. Go back to Kintai? How about you, senora? It's better for us there. You gotta be kidding. Hell, you can make more money here than you ever could in Kintai. Mom! Huh? What? Here, here, hold that, senor. Yeah, what is the life is up? What is it, Victor? If you're gonna go home, I want you to take that damn car with you, okay? Is this what you really want? It's what I really want. Thank you, boy. Goodbye. Goodbye. See ya. <laughs> part of telling a story. Did you like it? It was beautiful. It was good. Good. Okay. Everybody back in the house. Maybe tomorrow we'll take another trip. Okay? I'd like to wait to the morning sunshine. And as the sun starts its daily walk. 